Hi, this is Chris with Ignite Studio. I'm going to be going over the DIY project of the month for October, which is Saul Steinberg inspired masks. So as you can see, I am just wearing a paper bag on my head. All right, so I will take off my mask and talk a little bit about Saul Steinberg. So he was a cartoonist and an illustrator, and he would take sort of ordinary items such as the paper bag here um, and sort of elevate them. So for instance, he did, did drawings and they would be like in a bathtub. And so you would see like this lady reclining in the bathtub. He would take cardboard boxes and it would look like somebody was popping out of the box. And he did this with very basic materials. And so you'll find that in your pack, we just have a bag and a marker. And the only th other thing you'll need to grab would be a pair of scissors. So let's get started on making our own Saul Steinberg inspired masks. Okay, so we've got our very basic paper bag here. And one of the things that I found helpful in sort of laying out how you want to make your face is to use this crease here in the bag and put the eyes sort of right along that crease. And then of course this other crease here is sort of kind of your center. So if you think, if you're thinking of a face as being symmetrical on both sides, you can kind of think of this center line as your uh, mark as far as placing your eyes, your nose, your mouth sort of in the center there. All right, so I'm gonna get started on my eyes. And you don't have to follow any set design. Um, you know, you're kind of making this up as you go along. The more fantastical, the better. But I'm just gonna sort of draw my eyes in here. Okay, and then I'm gonna need some sort of nose. Here I've got my nose. And then I'm gonna add some eyebrows to this character. got my face. So now I'm just going to cut out sort of behind or turn the bag over and I'm going to cut out everything sort of but that front piece. got this top part still attached. That's the part I'm going to put over my head. And then I'm just going to cut out the lower portion. Give this guy a chin here. Okay. So now I'm going to show you my second mask here. I'll put this on. There you go. So that's really easy to do. Um, what I would love for you guys to do is actually take some photos uh, with your mask on and send them to us. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, any of those social media channels. We'd love to see what you've created. And happy making.